The Black Hawk takes off, and it's somewhere from about 1,750 feet, and it does a step down. Okay, and they're doing step downs, and I don't know the specifics of it, but you can read about it. I'm sure a lot of you have, but it, they do step downs at different altitudes, and the whole idea is to step down at different points and get to 200 feet and pass underneath the CRJ, okay? So we know that that's, that's what we've got going on. So we know the Black Hawk pilots had uh, different information. Um, they were One was getting a different readout than the other one on altitude, and there was some confusion going on in there. And so what ended up happening, the controller gave made the pilots of the Black Hawk the air traffic controllers. And we were not, that was a no-no as far as what we were taught. The, a pilot cannot be an air traffic controller. A pilot is a pilot. An air traffic controller is an air traffic controller. That was explicitly taught to us. As soon as you give separation to the pilots, you're in big trouble. And that's what happened here. Separation was given to the PSA crew solely to separate from the 172. They lost sight, and there you go. Okay? The controller in the Aeromexico lost situational awareness on the Cherokee because he was dealing with a Grumman, and that's what happened. This, the Embraer, the controllers were in-betweeners. In other words... The Embraer was in the process of, of, of going to departure off of the tower. Bad timing, but that's on the part of the controllers as well. So anyway, as far as how we were taught, okay? So the Black Hawk is approaching the Glide Soap. Now what I want you to think of in this example is, let's put our CRJ right, right here. So actually, let, let's do this. Let's go over here. What do we kind of know that happened? Did you know that there was another company aircraft, a CRJ, that they that the controller asked to go to runway 33 that said unable and landed on runway 1 prior to, to the CRJ 5342? All right, so let's walk through this little bit of a timeline. So we're going to put our Black Hawk at position A, okay? And they're working their way this way. So let's go to the CRJ, Flight 5342. Okay, so here we have Flight 5342.